Well, good, wonderful, beautiful morning, audience. We're packing up and heading home today. <laughs> we decided to only do a two-day trip. I got some stuff I got to do today. My aunt's leaving to go back to Arizona tomorrow, so we want to go home and have dinner with her. So we just came up here for, like I said, a short little two-day trip. And now we are packing up and heading home. It's going to be a beautiful drive home, though. I guess we should say bye to this color because there's definitely not as much at home. It's coming. It is coming. That's true. <laughs> it's it's definitely. We'll see it again in a week. <laughs> oh, it is so pretty though. Even a little bit south of here, it wasn't this bright. No. So, all right, fall. We'll see you again in like a week. <laughs> Look at how yellow these trees are. Yellows and red. Not a whole lot of red trees right here, but that's a different type of tree, isn't it? Uh, usually, yeah. There's a reddish tree. Yeah, maples will usually go red late. The oaks, uh, there are a lot of oaks here, probably a lot of them yellows you see. I think our maple tree is yellow, yeah, makes the yellow maple. leaves. I think red one was maple. So that's different than the maple we have in our yard. Because uh, ours makes yellow leaves. Uh, sometimes they go red, sometimes but yeah, ours is uh, in the backyard you're talking In the backyard, yeah, it's a sugar maple, right? Yeah. Gosh, look at right there. So pretty. Alright, bye fall colors. It's really pretty. Yeah, it is. I know, it's hard to turn the camera off, it's so pretty. <laughs> we're back on the Mackinac Bridge, and we're on the Greats, the musical bridge today. Yeah, right. Can you guys see the color over there? There's definitely, yeah, I mean, even, we were only gone, what, two and a half days, yeah. but there's already more color oh, yeah. on our side of the bridge. Yeah, are you going across the bridge, Miss Memphis? Yeah, you look so happy. Did you have a good time camping? You wanna go home? So like, no, we stay up here forever. There's so much fun up here. <laughs> and this here's our best little traveling pup ever. She just sleeps the whole time. She gets in the car and she lays down, she goes to sleep. She's a pretty good traveling pup. Get your go, 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 yay! You made it. You made it home. Are you happy? <laughs> Is she going for apples or going to pee? She's like, um, um, there's apples back here. She's probably going for apples. <laughs> She's like, no, I'm so excited. I get to run around. Oh, so our trees haven't changed that much. Oh, the neighbor's tree has. Yeah, I was going to say, I thought I saw... Yep. There's two of them. You don't want to look at that one because that's a sun. <laughs> <laughs> but ours haven't changed no. too much. Nope, our front yard one, not, not either. There she goes. Is she going for it? And... Maybe? Yep. She's going to go find an apple. The apple trees! You going to find one? Or are you just going to... Pick one off the tree. I know, there's still been like 10 apples sitting right there. She's like, I don't want any of these. These are not fresh. I've got to find a right apple. Is she going to find one? She's climbed up in the other one, the leaning one. Yeah. To pick one higher, but the, you can clearly see some on the front one that she hasn't grabbed yet. Uh-huh. She's looking for the perfect apple. Oh. oh, she got it. This one's the perfect one. <laughs> oh, she spit it out. That one's not perfect. It's smushy. It might be. Don't want the smushy ones. <laughs> Are you looking for an apple? You dork. Oh, there she goes. She got one. Yep, that one she's eating. <laughs> Is he alive or dead? So Jamie just texted me a picture. I'm assuming that was another text from you? Yeah. So what is the deal with snakes in our yard? Or snakes that we've seen the past couple days. Where is he? Oh God! So he's he's not too thrilled about being chased across the yard. I was chasing him across the yard to get him kind of out of the yard, and then I realized that he was definitely a little bit more unique than most you guys see snakes him? around here. He's right there. And then I tried poking him in the butt with the roller thing, and he started fighting. Really? Yeah. So watch. Are you watching? I'm watching. He's little. I don't want to watch, but. He's like, I don't mind the leaf. Ooh. He's like, I'm gonna defend myself if I have to. That's crazy. You don't like this thing. Well, yeah, it's huge. Look at it. <laughs> Jamie's out here so, picking up acorns with the nut roller. Yeah. Whoa! 
He ain't happy. So I wonder what kind he. I don't know what kind of snake. That is not a garter snake. No. He's got kind of, reminds me of like a Michigan rattler, but. I don't know. I don't see anything on his tail. He's got a very long, slender tail. Huh. He doesn't shake it or anything, but he's he's mad. You're a mad little snake, huh? You gotta go. Hold on, let me get some pictures of him. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and then you gotta go or somebody's gonna eat you. Yeah, that might not be good. Ooh, the lighting looks really funky and the camera's kind of bouncing, but. Now that we got the snake situation under control, I'm on my way out to Munchie Crunchy's Apple Farm to meet up with my mom and dad and Danielle and John Carl and John Matthew and, and whoever else is there, my family, and go to the Apple Farm and then I gotta go back into town, pick up Jamie and we're going out to dinner. He stayed home with the dogs instead of coming to the Apple Farm, mainly because we just got home and he was outside cleaning up the backyard. Thank goodness, because he found the snake before the dogs did. And I don't know what kind of snake that is, so if you guys want to leave some suggestions, don't forget, we live in northern Michigan. So leave some suggestions on what kind of snake you think it was. So anyway, I'm going to the apple farm. Which means I should probably bring Kira home some apples. Even though she has enough in our own yard. <laughs> Lots of apples. This place has changed so much over the past few years. Look, you can even pick your own apples now. And look, we're gonna go buy all the pumpkins. Not really, but we should. That's for me? Look at him. He's like, that's for me. That's, you're supposed to be feeding me. You remind me of my dog. Oh, oh, really? Really? You think so? You think you think so? <laughs> yeah? You think so? Oh. <laughs> you are not very nice. That's the attack goat. That's the attack goat. Did you see him attack that goat? <laughs> You're not a very nice goat. <laughs> you gotta get your fingers. He wants it, huh? Flat hand, mom. No, no. Yeah, what are you doing? Good God. Flat hand, mom. <laughs> Who is that? Look out, he's gonna attack them other goats if you don't feed him. He's like, um, none of it fell in, lady. There, it all fell down there. I can't, what do you want me to do? Flat hand, here you go, flat hand. There you go. There you go. Where's the piggy? <laughs> These goats are waiting for all kinds of food, aren't you? Sorry, he ate it all. Don't worry, you'll get more. I got nothing, look, nothing. I got nothing. You guys are as bad as the dogs. There's pig, we're at the petting farm, if you can't tell. Look, here's ponies. What? I got nothing. I got no food for you. What? Yeah? Oh, you're cute too. I don't got anything. I got nothing. I don't have no more quarters. I got nothing. Nothing. Got no more quarters. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> you're really pretty. You're both really pretty. Yeah, you are. What do you think, pup? Are you happy to be home, huh? She's like, I got my couch and I'm so comfy. Kira already went to bed. So we're gonna go ahead and call it a night. We hope you guys enjoyed today's video. As always, thanks so much for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Stay positive, dream big. We will see you again soon. Good night, audience. If you love our huskies, come along for the ride. All you have to do is hit subscribe. Follow as we share our lives with our dogs and join our adventures on Snow Dog Vlogs.